Good morning YouTube. I'm still filming on the GoPro because my camera, I took it into repair, but it's still not done yet. So that was that was always fun when I went to knock on and they were shut on Tuesday and Wednesday. No idea when lockdown, whatever. Uh, we're at Donington Park. This, this is my favorite circuit. I absolutely love this circuit. And we're here in not my mini, sadly, because it still needs to get a few more mods, but it's actually going into lockdown tomorrow. So luckily we managed to get booked on Donington Park. We're here in the new track car giveaway car. So we're in a mega track spec FN2 Civic now. You know what I'm like with Hondas. I've drove this here. It was the worst drive here ever. I mean, it took us about two and three hours because of traffic. We're a bit late, so I'm going to wrap this up quick. Going to get the GoPro on the helmet. We're going to go straight out on track, and it's been absolutely ages since we've been on a track day. So I'm intrigued to see what this car's like. One thing I've noticed already is that the, it's not like the EP3. This is where the steering rack's dead loose. The steering rack's actually really tight in it, so I actually think I might enjoy it. This car's built by Area Motorsport as well, so it's got some good heritage. But yeah, let's get out because I'm sick of waiting around. Right, so here's the FN2. It's pretty. Uh, pretty meaty little Civic to be fair uh, it's got some tasty bits on it I'm not going to go over all the mods because perfectly honest I don't really know them right now I'm probably just going to get out do the sighting laps get out of the way get a little bit you know warmed up a bit uh, and then come back and give you some more assist laps because yeah let's just jump straight into the driving but it's a good little track car so let's have a go shall we So it's a, uh, there's nothing in here. It is a push start. Right, absolutely nothing on the doors. So you imagine driving down here for two hours and this wasn't the best experience ever. But the only thing is I'm a little bit further away than I'd like to be sitting, but there are some rails on here, uh, but I'm not sure how to use them. And I just want to get out and just get warmed up a little bit first. So, uh, so we are with track, uh, with track Obsession today. <laughs>
Right, so what's happened is on that first lap, something's, uh, I think we've got another Honda with a selector issue. It's not going into third properly. It's kind of like being dead sloppy in third. So I've had to just do that whole session uh, without third gear, just straight into fourth. And it's actually fine. You can actually carry enough speed in fourth. The only, the only area I lack a little bit is when um, I'm coming out of a corner, like I'm just nowhere in the power range. So. <laughs> That's the most annoying thing but it is actually quite doable it's probably if it had a bit more power you've actually probably just could do second gear and fourth gear all the way around to be fair fourth and fifth so i don't think you ever need to drop lower than to third <sighs> maybe that's what's done the selector me just obviously because it is quite a high range if you are in third it's quite a high range so i don't know but the selector's gone in third so we have to do that all in fucking fourth gear it was still fun i just wish i had a little bit more power in like mid-range because people just pull away from me on the exit but no it's still good fun hopefully uh james and track obsession and all them are getting some good pictures because that's why we're here with this guy to get some cool pictures but no it's fun i'm glad we come off though there was so much traffic then i couldn't believe how much traffic there was like jesus christ you have a few twitchy moments <laughs> times where obviously because the selector's just getting sloppy now um i keep meaning to go into fourth and he keeps slipping into sixth and it's so annoying because i just lose everything i'm like Ugh. i'm like oh fucking hell what an animal mate honestly the car absolute animal uh, these tires not sure what they are mrf really 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 good i'm not gonna absolutely burn the hell out of them um but yeah i say it's a good all polycarbonate windows nice seats all been um painting inside on the floor as well so it's actually really nice good harnesses seats are really nice uh they're quite tight perfect size for me and the wheel is absolutely lovely as well it's a beautiful car to be fair tidy under the bonnet i'll show you under the bonnet right. it's nice and tasty under here to be fair like it is actually fast i actually really prefer these and the ep3s i know that on paper these are technically slower um but i do actually prefer this and the ep3 uh, you've got a lovely intake just going down the bottom there so it's in the wheel well um it's actually a, a foam one so it looks like a canine one down there uh look, yeah thank you there they are nk rpf ones i'm not entirely sure what brake pods are on uh, as you say if you want a full spec they'll be in the uh the description below but yeah here it is what a car super fast really 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 fast i like as well like these ones it's not <laughs> i actually prefer these on the ep3 so far um just wish i had third gear <laughs>
who was leading that traffic, but that was so bad. Unreal, what a lap. So much fun. That guy in the Civic was good. Mate, this, the, I think in terms of like people driving like dickheads, I think this has been one of the worst ones I've been on, to be honest. Mate, get out of the fucking way. coming in front of you and just slamming on like so it's uh i don't know it, some people have not been the breast um respect today let's just say that a lot of most people have a lot of people pulling over saying thank you so there's been a couple of people who have just been driving a bit silly to be honest not like too aggressive but there is quite a lot of traffic and people are just like slamming on people are coming in and, and, and not indicating and stuff it's there's been a couple of times where i'm glad my brakes have been good but over the night, everyone else has been sandwiched. Just a couple of people, I, I think, who just haven't been on many trap days. Uh, that's, the, that's the last time we're going to take it out. Um, as you say, I don't want to, I want to just come here to get enough content for the Instagram and just, you know, have a fun in the car and show the car off. I don't want to absolutely batter it. So we've done three sessions, uh, all probably around about five, ten minutes each. Car's amazing. Uh, as you say, the brakes were getting hot at the end then. I put it on, coming off the last corner, coming into the uh, turn one. Uh, I, where you don't want brake fade, I got quite a little bit, so yeah, we'll come off. But I think that's going to be us for the day. Going to drive home now. I'm going to go and look at another car tonight to buy. Hopefully, it's nice. I probably will buy it unless something's wrong. Um, no, I've had a good day. Look at this Lotus. Lotus is, is beautiful. Lovely, lovely, lovely car. I bet that is fast. Uh, but it's been super busy. Like, there's times where there's like a whole queue, like I was going around then. I was noticing like a whole queue in the pit lane and like obviously just seeing people on track and it has been busy obviously it's the last day of fucking before lockdown but no i'll we'll continue the video a little bit more but i think that's the last of the driving right so we dropped the car off at the garage uh, adam's actually took the gearbox off and uh, took the gearbox apart and he's found it's the selector fork that's gone uh, I googled them and apparently they're actually really common uh, tego are actually uh, actually sell aftermarket ones because apparently they say they break or bend that's what's happened in our scenario. So he's actually doing it at the minute, so it's gonna be ready tomorrow. So I'm gonna get the Civic tomorrow and take it back into London, and then it's gonna be ready for whoever wins the Civic. So yeah, this is why we take them on track. Uh, we like to put them through the paces so we actually can see any issues, eye them out, change them, and then obviously you get a good car. So yeah, gonna go to sleep gonna get ready to drive that car back into London tomorrow, which is gonna be amazing. We well, hope you enjoy the video. I certainly had such a good day and uh, good luck to our renters. <laughs>